Are you ready? I don't know what I'm in for at all. We've never recorded a video together. Never. This is a different experience. It's different. It's something new entirely. <laughs> Welcome, everyone. Hi. I'm your humble host, Hot, hot Man. <laughs> I'm here with the beautiful, the bountiful, the. Give me another beat. Bombastic. Bombastic. Buxom. Buxom. What does that mean? It means big boobs. Nandre from the twitch.tv world. We were asked by the great old internet, what's the craziest food you've ever eaten in combination with each other? And by the internet asked us, I mean, I thought we should try weird food combinations. I didn't know you outsourced this one to the internet. I didn't outsource it to the internet, but Jocelyn did outsource to friends of mine that work in the restaurant industry or are currently chefs. I don't want to call them out, but I feel like pregnant women especially have very strange food combinations. You could have asked my sister-in-law. Yeah, it's too late. Ah! You missed the window I on this I missed watch. the window. Well, she's currently in labor. Exactly. So like, there's still time. Get her there's on the There's still line. time. I'm sure she would appreciate a FaceTime call from me right now. Hey, what are you craving? <laughs> she's just screaming. An epidural. <laughs> I don't know any of these food combinations. You don't know any of these food combinations. Actually, I do know one of them because I requested it. Have you ever put yellow mustard on mac and cheese? I like yellow mustard. Uh -huh. Do you like mac and cheese? And mac and cheese is a little strange, but okay. I'm, I'm not opposed to this one. Bring it out, Joss. Yeah. Yellow mustard, mac and cheese. Yellow, yellow mustard, mustard, mac and cheese. Yellow mustard, mac and cheese. Yellow mustard, mac and cheese. Yellow mustard, mac and cheese. <laughs> This is like in the class of like things I would try in the, in the cafeteria, you know? She's already mussied up. Oh, yeah, yeah there's mustard. This is not the mac and cheese that I requested. Excuse oh? me. Oh, no, 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 no. I said Annie's mac and cheese. The white cheddar Annie's mac and cheese. Oh. It's the purple box. Yes, I did. Those are good. I. <laughs> Asked for Annie's mac and cheese, the white cheddar with the purple box. What are you even filming? Uh, cheers. Wow. See, I, I, it's not as good as the the white cheddar. I think the white cheddar actually would have really paired well here. With the, <laughs> this is more mustardy than it is cheesy. Mm -hmm. I, I think you're right. I think the uh, the ratio of cheese to cheese to mustard is all off because of the kind of cheese. You know, this is whatever this is. You know, American yellow stuff. But if you went with a nice, mm, like a, mm, like a, like a purple box. I'm envisioning a purple <laughs> box. <laughs> some sort of purple box. What is that? Cheddar? Some, cheddar? Some, Mild? Some kind mm. of <gasps> shell shape. Uh, yes, a white cheddar maybe. Mm. And maybe it's something that I already actually asked for. We'll never know. I think I asked you in person, so you can't prove anything. <laughs> <laughs> What's our rating scale? We should we should know that out. You one out of ten? Just a basic one out of ten. Yeah. This is inoffensive. Ten is like really good, right? Ten is like I would make this for a loved one. Are we going stars? Should we do? Uh, can we do Neo from I the feel Matrix? Like we can do shells. But like, not everything's gonna be mac and cheese. Bro. Yeah, but we could rank everything in the shell shape. Just yeah. to rub it in. <laughs> yeah, can you, uh, you can do a white cheddar, Annie's mac and cheese, white cheddar shell, or you can just do that classic purple box. <laughs> we can four and a half Annie's white cheddar shell purple boxes out of 10. <laughs> yeah, four and a half Annie's white cheddar mac and cheese. Boxes. Bring on the next load. Ooh, I thought sir. you were pulling something out of the dishwasher. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> dishwasher meat. This is like a, um, a Midwest classic here. People but I'm pretty sure this? it's supposed to be cheddar. <laughs> <laughs> pretty sure it's supposed to be white cheddar from a purple box. <laughs> wow, this is gonna really rock my world. I don't want it. We should not have said all that stuff about the white cheddar, huh? It's not bad. I didn't even taste the cheese. 
Mm, going in for a second. You know what the problem with it is? It feels like I'm chewing flubber. Like, it's so gooey. <laughs> yeah. It's, yeah, it's real gooey. The only thing that's gonna get me today, I think, is textures. There was really not a lot going on here. It's, not a lot to be desired. It just tasted like pie incredibly. I cannot mm -hmm. believe how little American cheese came through on yeah. this. Yeah, I think that's a solid middle ground. A solid five out of 10 mac and cheese boxes. I, I like this more than I like the mac and cheese. Yeah, 5.5 5 for our It looks dessert. heinous. It does not look okay. I had to really like look away while chewing because I think that really did me in. You ever eaten bugs before? A lot of the bugs really don't taste like anything, but you just have to not look at it and you have to remind yourself or tell yourself that you're not actually eating mm -hmm. bugs. I'm trying to mix a couple things, but this uh, almond butter with pickles. Almond, almond butter, butter with, with pickles? pickles? Uh, I'm Did you ever have peanut butter with pickles? I'm not a peanut butter lover. That was not my thing growing up. I have a question. Mm. How come there's turkey and cheese in it? I combined it. So people do pickles and peanut butter or peanut butter in like their burgers or their sandwiches. I just combine all those. Peanut butter and butter. I've had it. It's actually kind of good. Peanut butter and savory stuff isn't too strange, you know? Penang curry. I don't mind it. The pickles are kind of overpowering, which I don't mind because I like pickles. It's, you know. a, it's a texture thing. Bad? It's just so much more gooey. There's a little goop in here for sure. But I can't keep smell, I, I, I keep wanting to get hits off of it. I can't smell anything anymore. <sighs> Maybe smell mine, because your pickles are so big. You got such a big pickle. Oh yeah. <laughs> you want to you do that? Do the wedding thing. Yeah, you want to do that? How do you do that? This is just goes back to me. We're biting our own. <laughs> uh, uh, <laughs> it's Nothing says romance like sharing your <laughs> almond butter, <laughs> turkey, American cheese, and pickle sandwich. No, oh baby, I'm juiced on this one. What do you mean I know what this is? What do you mean? It's a pickle wrapped in fruit, fruit, uh, fruit roll up with gushers. You know, you've never had that before. No. What the fuck is this? Did, did, did you have a job? You are I in can't get it off. for a treat. The sword and the stone. You gotta have a delicate touch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, come on. Come on. Oh. Oh god. I don't like the way this is <laughs> yeah, this a looks, lot. Can you can you tilt it? Dude, you have to eat that. <laughs> <laughs> Trust me. Oh yeah, the sandwich. Oh, uh, the sandwich was like a three. The sandwich was the worst one for sure. Yeah, it's just like there was nothing about it that I liked. Watching you <laughs> just <laughs> purple nurple this this. Oh no no no! You gotta stop playing with your food. <laughs> Eat your fruit I got roll up it. pickle. I got okay? it. Okay, we gave it. you extra gushers. I got it. I got it. I'll take some of these. Put them back in. This is what a botched circumcision looks like. <laughs> you bring it around town. <laughs> okay. Okay. I would cheers you, but I don't want you to destroy it. Mm. You don't like it? I kind of like it. No, thank you. <laughs> I don't like it, the way that fruit roll up stick to your teeth. True. You gotta like that. Mm -mm. I don't like it. I love gushers. <laughs> I love pickles. <laughs> I, I love to go up. If you give me a mark at the same time, I would have a camper. No. This is definitely <laughs> napkin core. This might be a snack that you have to take a shower after. Here, it's slightly wet. <laughs> <laughs> that was epic. That might have been the coolest thing I've ever done. Next meal, next meal. What would you rate that one? Oh. Personally. Because this is gonna be the first one I think we, di we divert. Mm. I'm gonna rate this two. A two? The worst two one? 2.86. Two and six. you better make the math right, Justin. The, that box better be 86% of the way. I'm gonna give this one an 8.73 repeating wow i think it's i think it was really good i love 8. pickles like weird pickle flavors you know there's like pickled lemonade kool-aid pickles do you have any foods that you're afraid are gonna come up i have one 
Was that the one you texted me about? Yes. The cottage cheese? Yes. If the cottage cheese comes I'm gonna out, eat it if it's on, if it's on the table, it has to be consumed. Well, I will eat it. Mm -hmm. I'll double down for you. You'll tank? Yeah. I really, I just don't want anything super jello. Mm -hmm. I just don't like jello. Really? It makes me want to throw up. Yeah. It's just, it's the consistency of it, it makes me want to die. Mm -hmm. So we've done three so far? Four. Okay. Four? We have 11 more dishes. <laughs> I feel good for, 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 for what, a third of the way, no, a quarter there's, of the way? There's a, it's a 15 course meal. We're gonna have to get, decide if we're gonna head on a Michelin star here at the end. Ooh. Did you know that Michelin Michelin stars came from the tire company. Did you know that Eric Aragorn breaks his toe in that thing in Lord <laughs> of the Rings? Oh my god. Is that A1 sauce? A1 and cottage cheese? Oh, why? At a sleepover once, I thought I was getting raspberry yo play, and it was cottage. Oh. <laughs> it was cottage cheese, and I ate it thinking it was yogurt. So imagine going in for a bite of yogurt and it's cottage cheese. I never yak harder in my life. I spiked it in the garbage can, and then I angrily went to bed first at the sleepover. So then they came and they rubbed it <laughs> on my face while I was sleeping, and I woke up and I threw up all over myself. Pick me up. It's five in the morning. I'm, I'm done. <laughs> that is so bad. I, you don't have to do. This. I have to do this. I need to do this bite. <laughs> if you did the show, I'm doing the bite. If you must. I, I, yeah, I gotta do it with the spoon because I don't want to tape this. It looks <laughs> I, devious. Record, this is really bad, and I like cottage cheese. This is like. I think I can make it to the bathroom in time. Well, there's a sink there. Uh, the last time I had Kachis, I had to get obliterated drunk. <laughs> that was the plan, was be blackout, so I didn't know. Makes it easier for me because it's so strong. It's really overpowered. Oh my. I'm giving it a one. Oh. Point seven. I'm giving it a skull and crossbones. <laughs> just, <laughs> just skull, flaming skull and crossbones. Again, these are things that people do. This isn't just oh. random food thrown together. I mean, I guess at one point it was. This is stuff that people do. It's in my teeth. What? Please, God! Please! No, 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 I can't do it! We have to. <laughs> you just have your phone and a slide whistle sticking out of it. I gotta be prepared. <laughs> how, did that, how did eating that make you feel? It reminded me... <laughs> ...of my grandmother's funeral. <laughs> <laughs> that was the sandwich! <laughs> Nan saw his grandmother's vagina. <sighs> this, this is your favorite? Rice and ketchup? What the fuck? This uh, is, looks like the Target logo. <laughs> Why'd you do that? <laughs> I don't really like ketchup. I don't either. But this could maybe work. Okay, hear me out. No. This tastes like something I used to eat all the time. <laughs> Campbell's tomato soup and rice. Yeah, actually, It literally tastes it just taste like, like it. Campbell's tomato soup. Man. Campbell's tomato soup is way too ketchup-y. Yeah. They put too much ketchup in there. I think a reason why I have a hard time eating ketchup sometimes when it's like so much ketchup, I would make videos with my friends growing up and we would make fake blood out of ketchup. Oh. So it, just like the smell of it reminds me of like smearing ketchup and water oh. on my friends' faces to make fake blood. I'm ready to get a three out of 10. Three point 
far. I'm gonna be honest, I think that's the second best thing I've had today. I don't love it, but I don't hate it. I'm gonna give it 6.6, .6, almost the number of the beats. Actually, I'm, I'm gonna rate it higher than the sandwich. I'm gonna yeah. give it a 5.2. What? I didn't even know this is a thing. <laughs> butterscotch pudding? I thought that's the only thing in Undertale. Oh, it smells nice. It does actually, it smells like a candle. Well, here we go. A little dippy. I'm gonna go full submersible here. Oh, wow. Titanic soap. Very desserty. Yeah, you know that's not bad. But also, I don't know if I've ever been in like a place mentally where I would like want to try this. <laughs> like thing. this is a post, this is a really bad breakup meal. You're right, this is not a snack, this is a meal. <laughs> yeah. This is girl dinner. I'm gonna give this like a seven and a half, I think. Yeah, that it's feels It's really fair. like not bad. What are you doing for this? I think seven five is a really good rating for this. Okay. Is that mail? Is this? Is this Hellman's? This is <laughs> stupid. Are you a mayo person? No, not really. Me neither. I'm not a big mayo guy. Oh. <laughs> it, yeah, you do it. You do it. You let me know what I, I'm getting. Oh, it's so good. You're gonna love it. <laughs> oh, what is up with that? It changes everything. <laughs> it feels like getting tased. <laughs> Stop! <laughs> it keeps going. It does. It lasts forever. I hate you. It's terrible, but I could see why somebody would love it. Oh, Mitch McConnell would love this. <laughs> <laughs> this is what Mitch McConnell did before he paused. I'm giving that a two point. I'm gonna give it a one and two and a half Mitch McConnells. This looks awesome. So these are flaming hot. Whoa. Flaming hot Cheetos. Yeah. I like you're stirring. I feel like this might be good. This one I have really, really high hopes for, and I've never heard of this as an idea. I think that this could be the key. So this is what we this is the missing link. This is a keeper. Uh -huh. I don't mind it, you know? I don't mind it, but do I crave it? It's like, would I eat a spicy strawberry? Yeah, I think I would. I think this might be the best of the bunch. I'm gonna give this an eight. I think it's just under the, the picklezilla. This is gonna be an 8.32. What was the other one? A tenth of a decimal under. <laughs> Come on, bro. Come on, dude, don't worry about it. What the heck? I love your squirt pattern. Look at that squirt pattern. <laughs> I'm just gonna take a dip here. Oh, God. This is gonna make me wanna fucking die. This, there's no way that this is good, right? I want to level it up. Oh, you're gonna, you're gonna do a schmear? I, can I have the bottle of ketchup, please? Ketchup? Bah, mustard. Now. This is how they make them at supper. <laughs> You're like Oppenheimer right now. <laughs> uh -huh. That. Sore bad. Look at that, huh? Well, best of luck. Uh, it's not good. I don't like it. These are pretty inoffensive in my opinion. I'm thinking like a, a five-ish area. Yeah. I think five even. Yeah, five even? This right. feels like right in the middle of the road. I don't want to eat more of them, but I can eat one if I have to. I am gotta, gotta say, I, there's, there's a treat brewing in me. Why is it always Why mustard? Why is it so much mustard? That's what they say. 
I, okay, so I already don't like watermelon. It kind of looks like tuna. It does, wow, if you think of it, this looks like, literally looks like a $40 like sushi thing. All right, I'll take the big piece. Oh yeah, I probably should. Yeah, it's just got, you gotta have a full even coat. It doesn't smell bad. I like kind of think this one might work of all of the mustard experiments. I don't know why I thought that. I don't love it. Um, the watermelon is so juicy okay. that it just makes like mustard water. How many more dishes do we have? That Four? One. Gotta take an intermission. Holy crap. Just that, gotta take an That intermission. one made me see God. Listen everyone, thank you so much for watching this far in the video. Um, we're gonna take a slight break. Uh, Justin, we're gonna <laughs> throw it to you. Uh, you're gonna do a nice little ad read for your, uh, your new product that you're selling, Justin. So take it away. Uh, you have fun with this one. I have to poop. <laughs> mm. Made made so much mud. <laughs> Is this more a one? Balsamic? Um, Soy sauce and ice cream? I feel like it could work with the right flavor, but right now the smell coming off this thing is like putting my nose in an ox's tuss. Very interesting. We'll get a little bit of mustard in this as well. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna attack this, this top knob here and really sauce it up. Mmm, mmm. It starts off really salty, oh. and then it kind of turned to caramel. I kind of like that. It starts off really salty. Really, really salty. Like it kicks you in the face, and then it chills. When you have Ben and Jerry's, you grab a pint. Yeah, B and J's. Do you eat the whole pint in one sitting? I do. If you if you don't, did you even get the pint? Exactly. This. I think is the best dish so far. The only reason why the pickle is better mm -hmm. is that the gusher I, pickle? I finished the pickle. That was a solid 8.7. I'm gonna give it 7.7. Seven. Okay, so this is an actual snack we eat in Mexico. Oh. It's an actual snack we eat in Mexico. This is called uh, Toasty Locos. Toasty Locos? Toasty Locos. This looks awesome. Is it kind of like ceviche? So what's in this? Jalapeno. So there's cucumber, tamarind candy. There's lime, what's that? There's chamoy, valentina hot sauce, tostitos, which is the mm. chips, and then the white things are pork rinds. Oh, hell yeah. Okay, this actually looks, it smells awesome. It's very messy, which I'm here for. Okay, it comes back around, actually. At first, I was like, I don't think I like that. It is such a one more bite, one more bite meal. Yeah, that's actually really, really oh good. Oh my god, it's so good. I'm giving that a 9.837. Definitely the best thing we ate. But did I like it more than the pickle? And I think I did. I want to give this one a 9.08. 9 9.08? Yeah. Do you know that there's a family in there? Eating chips and salsa. <laughs> Did you know that? On the logo, there's a little family eating chips and salsa. Is there really? No. Oh. oh my god. Uh -huh. Right there. There's two people eating chips and salsa. Have you noticed that before? Did you know that there's a arrow in the FedEx logo? <laughs> <laughs> I also kind of feel like that was the calm before the storm and now we're entering just hell. Are you scared? I, I have like existential dread right now. <laughs> like, well, Justin awesome did say the last one is really gross. God. The worst by far has been the cottage cheese. It, the cottage cheese was so heinous on so many ways. We have something worse than the cottage cheese. What? <laughs> worse? So this one's from TikTok. This one, people liked. This is a, cute, uh, a pickle with an otter pop inside and then tahini and chocolate. What is an otter pop? Like a popsicle? Oh, oh, the like, uh, the frozen thing? Here, here, I'll take it. That pickle is <laughs> this is a huge That pickle, pickle is well below average. Do you put this in the freezer? Whoa. I eat it. It looks like somebody's thumb. 
<laughs> I'm gonna go from the from the end. Okay. I don't know if that's the strap, but I'm gonna do it. I don't make a lot of faces. That's just because it's cold. It's actually not that bad. <laughs> so look at the neon green <laughs> inside. Are you gonna not even pick it up? I don't know what to do. <laughs> if I stand like this, you wanna put the plate <laughs> right here? Dude, you gotta try it. <laughs> I'm telling you, it's great. I can't bite into it. Be, gent be gentle. <laughs> I don't think I could eat the whole thing. No way. No one could. Oh, it's not bad. It's not bad. I actually like, kind of like it. It's just there's so much going on. Yeah. In the head to head pickle fight. In the head-to-head -head pickle <laughs> fight, I think I'm gonna take the fruit roll-up pickle. I really like the fruit roll-up pickle. I might go eat one at home. I'm gonna say a solid 7.8. I'm going even eight. I would never order it, but if somebody offered me a bite, I'm happily accepting. Wait, this is the last one, isn't it? This is the worst? It's supposed to be the first one. Oh my God, is that Pepto-Bismol? <laughs> This is Pepto ice cream. Look at the color on that thing. I, <laughs> I am excited. I love Pepto Bismol. What if it fucking slaps? It's going to, it's, you could smell the medicine off it. I'm surprised we could smell it from the other side wow. of the room. How many doses of Pepto is this? No idea. You just did the whole bottle. The noise off that. Gave me goosebumps. Oh God, it's clearing up my sinuses. This could be it. Like, this like, could be like, the last time I see you. <laughs> it's been a good run. Clink, clink. Hey. <laughs> it's not awful, which is the thing. <laughs> Like it just tastes like Pepto Bismol. Because it is, it's just Pepto. Why did it texturally feel like eating sheets of ice? Oh, yeah, it did. Why do I love it? <laughs> I feel like if you had a brownie, if you had a brownie and put Pepto ice cream on top of it, it'd be kind of sick. That was better than I expected it to be. You want to blend them? The, the mega blend? Yeah, we got it. it, it it's just, it needs to be done. Oh. <laughs> that is insanity. What if this is what grows my hair back? <laughs> is this gonna blend? Oh, it'll blend. Oh. Don't be shy with those. That might be our thing that saves us. One whole mustard watermelon. This is the silliest thing I have done in a while. And of course, how could we forget ketchup rice? The side profile on this thing is otherworldly. Lovecraftian. Are you ready? Are you ready? Yeah. <laughs> Top it off with some LD. Yeah, put some liquid death in there. Just a little sparkle. Nice. Yeah. The smell of this concoction rivals anything that has flown up my sinuses in my entire existence. It is heinous. <laughs> Oh my God, why does it smell like berries? I'm not a religious man, but this could do it for me. Willy Wonka could never. 
<laughs> Timothy Chalamet, eat your heart out. <laughs> Look at the texture on that thing. It's gluey. <laughs> I'm going to take a seat, please. <laughs> look at the, come it, on, look at the legs on that. This is what everybody turns into at the end of Evangelion. Oh my god, that smells. The smell is so bad. <laughs> no, we don't have to drink all of it. No. <laughs> There's no world. It takes so long. It's so long. <laughs> I just burped so hard, I farted. I don't know if it's gonna come up, but I just... this video make sure to go check out Nadre. it'll be the link in the description oh. he uh, is a great streamer make sure to go check him out we'll see you next time don't forget to like and subscribe thank you so much for watching Okay, we can cut. <laughs> oh, we don't need to.